Okay. More than equipped to take you on. Anything better to do?
this might even the odds. Yeah, so. but this <laughs> snow chill it just in the bushes right here Vaz says you gotta eat dirt. to get through. They must use these to protect themselves from that awful sound.
after a ball try to break me. Shows what he knows. I, sh I should have been with you. Why didn't you come for me? I, I know I'm a useless trunk, but... No, idiot. I got a message from Durval saying he wanted to parlay. I didn't come for you because I knew it was a trap. I couldn't let you get hurt. Just didn't think it'd be that good a trap. Thought I could take him out. <laughs> no. Now listen. Duval's planning something big in Meridian. He said he'd force Avad to watch as the smoke darkens their precious sun. Your king needs you. No more playing around. You're gonna have to grow up fast. I, I will. I promise. You damn well better, little brother. Ursa. No, no. Please. <laughs> I won't let you down. I promise. Miranda. I'm so sorry. You've got to find Durval. But Meridian's a big place. I'll... I'll look through his things. Maybe we can narrow it down. Such a strange device. It's beautifully crafted. What happens when I turn it on? I think I've got it working. There. Now, say something. Both of you doves. I don't know. What do you want me to say? Whatever you want. I, I just want to hear your voice and keep it for later. I'll sing, Papa. La 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 la. <laughs> there. A song and a laugh. Even better than words. And now I can hear them whenever I want. We're done then? Off to bed with you. Good night, Mama. Good night, Papa. Is she gone? What are we going to do? The raids are getting closer and closer to Main Spring. How much longer can we hide like this? A keepsake from his family. Durval's got nothing left to lose. Just notes about crafting. And a letter tucked between the pages. Lots of blaze. Headed to Meridian. If we find it, I'll bet we find Durval too. My loyal customer, Aelin Forgeman. I hope your plans for a forge in Upper Meridian are moving forward. And we're honored you chose us to provide the blaze you need. We've received payment for the third shipment, and we are most thankful for your prompt remuneration. Unfortunately, our hunters are struggling to cover the order. We apologize for the delay, but this is an unusually large request. As soon as we have it, we'll deliver it to you, uh, or to your warehouse as promised, with the utmost respect. Uh, Gerund, Hunter, Master, Mainspring, Machine Makings, Clan Charter 17A21. So he bought a crap ton of blades and brought it to Meridian where he's going to try to use it to destroy everything. I think I found something that can help. Let's head back to the palace. Go. I won't be long, but I need to tend to my sister.
need to sell off some of these. Probably. Just stick something weak in there to make room. Okay, let's uh, look at our quest list. Sun shall fall. Level 18. Yeah, let's do this level 16 one. Actually, we can finish this one. Okay, it's been sitting here at the very end. Why would you need? Need the rest. I've been all over the city and I can't find I've the I've got all the best goods here. Pass up these goods. Come take a look. Would you like Maybe to buy some? I've got all anywhere. the best goods here. Don't pass up. Buy what you need, leave the rest. Granger, what kind of room are you trying to attract? We were agree. I do the calling, take you do the count. I wouldn't say agree. I don't complain about your counting, other than it takes too long. I wouldn't have to check it twice if you'd stop droning in my ear. Ooh. Kept the wheel turning all day, and by the forge, I believe I've earned a drink or two. Smiling, like running. I promise. I brought you both the parts. So, what do you say? I don't suppose I could buy just the one. You'd buy the wrong one, so give the hunter her shards for both. Of course, of course. Here you are. If this is the price I have to pay... The price you have to pay? The snap maw lens might just cover the loss we take on the other. It won't sell for a loss, charcoal burner. You'd pay handsomely for a long leg lens if you had an imagination. I have an imagination. When you rattle that piece of junk around, I think of your skull. I told you from the beginning this wouldn't be a scrap dealing operation, that we would have class. And I told you a true metal seller knows to get his hands dirty. As you wipe machine oil on my silks. Who wears a silk apron to the metal markets? I do. Come take a look. I'll give you a good price. always makes me feel I can. Sometimes. Okay. 
So you'll like what I have for sale. You'll like what I have for sale. I promise. On the other side. That's just good. Uh, Won't cost you a shot. Wow, shirt. I'm actually really. Cool. Check out these wares. Not sure how that works, but. Here's what I don't get about the problem. All these fancy decorations everywhere. This will help.
free of the city. You are a better hunter than I. I'll paint the mark while the spirits of the Glintox linger. There'll be more where they came from. Yes, there will always be more machines. Their spirits find new bodies, but we only last as long as memory. That's why I must leave this story. A monument to our vanished shamans, to the wisdom the Karja bled from us. The machine oil in the paint will preserve it, preserve their memory against all that was cut away. You have my thanks, Hunter. Double tap to jump and then jumped right off of the rope. That was good. I did it again, but. Just uh, go over here to the no the lake shrine. Yeah, the lake shrine is, the, is number one. I'm trying to clean this just one on the way back. Yeah, I was thinking. Yeah, I just flip around. This is where the Otaru wanted to say her goodbyes. Kill the snap moths.
When we fled from our cages during the liberation, I tore through this clearing, thinking my friend was behind me. I kept running, but here she remains. Thank you for making it safe for me to return. I don't want to rush you, but it won't stay safe for long. I understand. I've done this before in waking dreams. In the pool, I'll find the bracelet of seeds she dropped when she fell. The seeds will be split, escaped, grown wild. She's passing from my memory into the jungles. I'll tell her it was I who died here and became a stranger in our own land. And she who still lives in every time of planting, of rains, harvests... <laughs> What is it? There. Her bracelet. And... I thought she was behind me. But there's only my reflection. Do you need to be alone? For the first time. I am. That's your business, Outlander. This must be the Shrine of Kings that Naman told me about. It's a public monument, not his private shrine. Hmm. I was just curious. Huh? Oh, 
Storm Slaves built that thing. We deserve to have a look. You won't get in there. That dried up old prune in a robe sees to that. I can be persuasive. But what does an Osram want with a Karja shrine anyway? It reminds me of someone. Gone two years now. But what does a girl like you know of loss? Try me. I had a lover. Worked on monuments to their bastard king. Then he gave them a show in their sun ring for good measure. The Karja gave me back his broken bones, but what use are they? They won't build again. They won't make me smile. And seeing a statue of the Mad Sun King will? I, I need to see his work again. The marks his hands carved. The set of the metals they hammered. That's the soul of him. But that shriveled up old priest won't let me near it. I'll see what I can do. Turn away, child. The abiding Jahaman wishes to be alone in his retreat. If you want to be alone, go someplace else. Others want to pray here. Defile it, you mean? Yet another debasement of what was once pure. Truly, our tribe has lost the light. Our king is false, our temple is corrupt, and our soldiers weak. The sun hastens across the sky for shame. So the Karja have become impure? What does that even mean? Is Meridian not meant for those who built it, who made it great? It was pure before outlander squatters took it over. You mean Meridian was pure when the outsiders were in cages or dying in your arena? The sun is pure, child. It is not our place to question its divine will, only to act upon it. I thought Avad taking the throne was the sun's will. The boy dishonored his father, dishonored us all. To kill the Sun King, what shadow, what twilight time he brought upon us. And how many more would the mad Sun King have killed if Avad hadn't stopped him? The sun called for blood. There was no choice but to obey. This guy would be better off with the shadow card, I swear. Like, why is he still here? You called the temple corrupt, but aren't you one of its priests? They call themselves sun priests, but they have no authority. Youths and sycophants all. Yet those who gave their whole lives to the sun's service are shamed and ignored. So that's what this is. A tantrum? A cry for attention? You know nothing of our rights, and yet you dare to insult me. Why do you think your army is weak? Because you're not at war with everyone? A Karja throne relying on forged dirt mercenaries? Preposterous! The so-called liberation was nothing but a purge. Our most blessed warriors, chased out of the city, exiled to Sunfall and the Forbidden West. Our tribe is torn. The ones who walked in light now go by shadow. And yet everyone but you seems happy they're gone. I'm done arguing with you. Stay or go, but I won't allow you to keep others away. I am here by the will of the sun. You don't believe in the throne, the priesthood, the army, or the city, so I guess you have no authority here. Uh, I have the authority of the sun! Then call it for help. No one else will listen. There'll be a reckoning. You'll back away from it. The Sundom will change in time, and it's been hammering out. He gave them the best work he'd ever do. And look at it now. They defaced it because they hated what it stood for. They defaced a thing slaves like him lived and died for. 
Slaves they've already forgotten. Short-sighted bastards the lot. If they thought their son set off this bridge, they'd jump after it. Probably. I thank you for honoring my wish. I hope you can find peace. I wouldn't know what to do with it. Any more than the Karja do. Like an so you've come back to the temple. I was invited back. The priests wanted to hear what I had to say about reconciliation with the other tribes. They're listening. At least they've begun to listen. There's a distance between ears and deeds. Because of what we did? What you did. It was for the mourners. I think it helped them. You set them on the path. You can't know what their journeys hold. Such is the priest's lot. Perhaps a red robe would suit you. <laughs> Not me. Besides, your temple doesn't even take women. We would be richer if we did. Go in light, my friend. And let the sun cast your way. Thank you, Naman. Where I'm going, I could probably use all the light I can get. Adventurers, preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosy. Damn cowardly shadow cards that must have jumped. Could you spare a moment to speak of the finer thing? I've sent a messenger to the claim to let everyone know. If there's anything you or your clan need for her arrangements, you need but ask. There'll be time for all of that later. Aloy. I'm glad you're back. I'm at a loss about Ursa. To learn she lives, then lose that hope, seems cruel. She wouldn't want us to waste time talking. She'd want us to find Durval. She said he raved about smoke darkening the sun. Tell him what you found in his papers. A letter. It mentioned a shipment of Blaze being sent to a warehouse here. Only, it wasn't addressed to Duval. 
The name was Aeland Forgeman. Does that mean anything to you? Uh, sounds familiar. Yes, a landlord. The Osaram have been buying up buildings across the city, including one under that name. Let me think. It's by the edge of the mesa, near the temple. It used to be a shop, but it could serve as a warehouse. If Durval used the name as an alias to buy it, he might even be there now. I'll round up my men. I'll meet you there. Aaron, wait. Remember that no one hates Durval more than your own tribe. The clans would give up much to obtain him. Take him alive? So you can haggle over him? You can't be serious! Our security depends on keeping the peace. If the opportunity presents itself, take him alive. Consider that a command. <clears throat> Aloy, a moment, please. When we spoke, Aaron didn't wish to dwell on the details of Ursa's death. Understandable, of course. But now that they've been left to my imagination, those details are all I can think about. You were there. Did she suffer? Oh, boy. She's not the one who's suffering now. You are. She died before you could say goodbye. Is it that obvious? You're right. I'm dwelling on my pain. Not just hers. And there's only one thing left that can help. Find Durval and bring him before me. He will answer for his crimes. Spare a moment to speak of the finer things. No, I really can't. Able bodied adventurers, preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosy. Keeps changing. This is the place. You home, Durval? I got a surprise for you. He has a surprise for us. Is it a bomb? Doesn't look too big. Big enough to kill us. All right. I'll shut up. Blaze. It must be leaking from something upstairs. I, I That's a lot of Blaze. If that bomb downstairs goes off... It'll be just what Durval promised. Smoke will darken the sun as the city goes up in flames. There's, there's got to be a way to stop it. If I try to take it apart, a booby trap will set it off. It looks like a wooden bracket, not very strong. Help me push this out. Okay. Brute force. I'm good at that. What'll it do? Save the city, I hope. But when the blaze falls, run for it. Because the booby trap on the bomb downstairs is gonna get set off. Uh, will we survive? Probably not. Now push. Ugh.
We did it! Durval's best shot, and Meridian's still standing. This isn't over. Durval said he'd make a VOD watch. No way. To do that, he'd have to get into the palace, and that's too heavily guarded. Get back there, just to be sure. I'm gonna look around. Maybe Durval's men left something behind when they planted that bomb. I got it. Don't worry. He tries for the palace. He's finished. Boot tracks with just a bit of blaze in them. Can I interest you in a reasonable shot? Get to the fire and set up a bucket line. What happened? I haven't heard a blast like that since the liberation. Everyone needs a splash of color. Oh, our place in the order comes. Things. Let's talk it over. There's smoke rising from the edge of the mesa. Are we under attack? The tracks lead inside. Another one of Durval's hideouts. This must be where Durval assembled the detonator. <sighs> he tunneled through the wall. Durval did find a way into the palace. Okay, well, we just hit an hour. Um, seems like a good place to stop. See you later. <laughs>